Hello and welcome to the Principles of Laboratory Biosafety course, a series of interactive learning modules that allows you to select material that best meets your needs and interests related to biosafety. The Public Health Agency of Canada and the Canadian Food Inspection Agency have developed this course to support your commitment to biosafety. It presents information on biosafety principles and practices while helping you to promote the safe handling of human or animal pathogens and toxins in your laboratory facility. At its core, biosafety is about applying the right knowledge, techniques, and equipment to prevent exposure to potentially infectious agents or biohazards. With the explosion of interest in biosafety in recent years, and with the steady increase in facilities handling pathogens and toxins, biosafety awareness and knowledge are more important than ever. In fact, they are the best tools we have for preventing personal exposure to infectious pathogens or the accidental release of pathogens into the environment. The educational material in this course reinforces knowledge of the principles and practices of biosafety and biosecurity. It also helps you minimize biosafety risks and promote regulatory compliance under the Human Pathogen and Toxins Act, the Human Pathogens Importation Regulations, and the Health of Animals Act and Regulations. The principles of Laboratory Biosafety course reflects the Government of Canada's belief that laboratory biosafety is a shared commitment. It's a commitment that involves people in every aspect of laboratory work, from designers and operators to students, researchers, managers, and regulators. Each of us has a role to play. The course material reflects this comprehensive approach, offering information on everything from microbiology and risk assessments to laboratory-acquired infections and general safety practices. The course's learning modules are designed with flexibility and ease of use in mind. Each module includes presentations, interactive segments, video clips, and knowledge checks and quizzes. After completing each module, you'll be issued a certificate. As a portal user, you can select modules that apply to your interests and take them in any order you wish. Course modules can be included in the learning roadmap of anyone requiring biosafety knowledge with the goal of having a consistent baseline level of knowledge. If you're responsible for biosafety education at your facility, you can use these modules as part of your training program for new and existing employees. Regardless of the size or capacity of your training program, these modules are excellent training tools. You can incorporate any or all modules into your program depending on your facility's needs and base your evaluation of employee understanding or knowledge uptake on material that's essential to you. This course recognizes that overall biosafety guidance at your facility and determination of best practices must be based on your own local risk assessments and all applicable laws and regulations. Though we review and update material regularly, Newly discovered hazards are frequent, and information may not always be completely up to date. So please, continue to check the Public Health Agency of Canada and Canadian Food Inspection Agency websites for updates and additional biosafety requirements. Whether you're a biosafety professional, a containment facility user or manager, an engineer, architect, or otherwise involved in the design, construction, and operation of containment facilities, we're confident this comprehensive course will be of benefit to you. It provides the knowledge and understanding you need to strengthen your biosafety environment and promote a safe and productive workplace for you and your laboratory colleagues.